Hey everyone, and welcome back to King's Quest 3, uh, To Air is Human. So, um, last episode, we did a lot of stuff. We uh, stole from the bandits. We turned into a fly. And yeah, we were. I was waiting for Mananan to get back home, and he, as you can see by the cloud over there, he came back home, and now he's telling me that he's hungry. So now we're gonna go feed him. Mananan is impatiently waiting for his food. His stomach grumbles as he drums his gnarled fingers on the table. You'd better feed him quickly or dire consequences may result. Give wizard button. You place the food on the dining table before the hungry wizard. Ravenously, he devours every bit of it. Yeah, good for you. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Good for you. Good for you, Mananan. And, oh, the heck. Do I have to wait until he's done? Apparently I do. Perfect. It's obvious the wizard enjoyed his meal as he sets out a satisfied belch. He rises and leaves without so much as a thank you. What a jerk. Get out of here. Okay, bye. jerk. Uh, now we're just gonna wait for Mananan to show up until it's that he's taking a nap. My boyfriend and his friend have a channel card called The Guarded Knees and I'm a part of it. We've been playing uh, Little Nightmares recently and for that video, for those videos I was really sick. Like I had, my throat was scratchy I did just did not feel good and then as the days went on my throat it got even worse like I couldn't even sleep properly because my throat was so sore and oh my god like I can't even I don't ever want that to happen again I even went to um, the doctor well I went to go see a nurse about my throat because I thought it was strep throat and because it was hurting so bad, but it just ended up being a really bad cold that I had, so yeah. Good thing it wasn't strep. I would have been so, so sad. Where the hell is Mananan? Come on, Mananan. Let's get this show on the road. I also hated being sick last week because um, usually in the mornings I would work out before I got ready for work for work and I couldn't do anything I couldn't I couldn't work out like I I tried to sleep I couldn't even sleep I was so miserable last week so that's why there was no video videos at all and uh, actually a lot of other things happened um, also that week so it was pretty crap pretty crappy week I suppose they're gonna go take a freaking nap or what sheesh finally I'm going to bed Gwydion do not disturb me finally frick alright now I gotta freaking god dang it crap I gotta grab the map and I gotta grab everything really fast. Do do do. Take all. Look map. Magic map faded. Uh, we're gonna go travel to uh, F6 and show it so it should be. And now we are going into the shop, the store, and we're gonna go buy some stuff. Hello, sir. Goodbye. What can I do you? Pet dog. Yeah, I got the, I got the uh, fur. Oh, look, he's wagging his tail. Cute. Okay, now we are going to buy salt. Boop, boop, boop. 
You have purchased the finest salt in the land, the friendly storekeeper informs you. That'll be one gold coin. What else can I get you? asked the uh, amiab amiable storekeeper. Buy. What am I supposed to buy? Fish oil. Boop boop. With a smile, the storekeeper says, I guarantee you will be happy with this fish oil, young sir. That will be one gold coin. And we are going to buy. The last thing we need to buy is buy lard. Well, actually, we need to buy a pouch. A fine choice indeed, young man, the storekeeper says, smiling. That will be one gold coin. Oops. So let's buy pouch. And I will get that. With a smile, the storekeeper says, I guarantee you will be happy with this pouch, young sir. That will be one gold coin. What else can I get for you? Nothing much. Okay. And then now we need to go. Uh, no, not very shredded. Okay, we gotta go this way. And then we gotta go. Aha! Now we are. We gotta go back into the freaking tree. Jeez. Now we're gonna go in the house. Uh, actually, we should save. We should save. We're gonna save this as the bears. There we go. Open door. Ah! Oh, Papa Bear! Whoops. Scram, girls, Papa Bear. We're not interested. Alright, I'm sorry. Alright, alright. Woo! Sorry. I guess I gotta wait till they leave. Mama Bear growls at you. You would hear the flower bed. Better stay away from it. And her. If you go out in the woods today. Come on, bears. Let's get the f get out of there. There we go. What's this three gold bears? You hear Papa Bear exclaim. What a beautiful day for a stroll through the forest. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If you go out in the woods today. You're sure of a big surprise. in chair. Huh, the chair feels just right. Oh no! Uh oh. Am I supposed to sit on all the chairs? There's no porridge on the table. I guess I'll go get the thimble. Oh, there they are. There's the porridge. Porridge. What's a porrid? Oh. Por porridge. I'm right there. Oh, because there's freaking chairs in the way. Jesus. Um, get porridge. This bowl of porridge is just right, so you take it with you. Ha ha. Let me go get some dew. Flower to flower, repeating the process. Um, am I supposed to get get water? Get water? You have no need to carry around the steam stream water. If you are thirsty, then just get a drink. Ugh, jeez. Get mud. With the wooden spoon, you kneel and scoop a spoonful of wet mud from the stream's bank. You carry it with you. Huzzah. Oh. Spider. We don't need to go there yet. If you go out in the woods today, that's just gonna be in my head all day. Okay, now we gotta go to the water. I think. You will fill your cup. You fill your cup with ocean water. Good for me. You search among the hanging toe until you find a spring that has dried. You break it off and carry it with you. Woo! I didn't know we were had to get that from there, but okay. 
And now we gotta go to the eagle. Whoop. Let's actually save the game. The bears. How convenient. Right in front of their house. All right, that's enough of that. I've been trying to get the eagle feather, but I'm pretty sure we can't right now, so we're just gonna try to get acorn. Why can't I spell acorn? Acorn. Ugh, get acorn. If pick a Pokemon and try it, take them with you. Hey! Holy heck! You eventually find three dried acorns and take them with you. Holy. Remember from the last episode, it took me like freaking forever to find these acorns, and now I found them in like two seconds. Now I gotta wait for this. Shit. What did I do? Alright, cool. I finally find the freaking acorns, and then I freaking restore the damn game. Oh, okay, well, it wasn't too bad. Did the same thing. Okay, now I'm gonna save. I'm not gonna restore the game. Save. The bears. The acorns. And now we gotta wait for this freaking eagle to show up and drop his. Oh, there we go! Finally! Get feather. Whoa, I'm like aggressive with my writing. Okay. All right. Go look at map. Map's faded ink. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now we gotta go to the cave. The cave of wonders. There we go. Okay. Dip. Eagle feather in essence. Essence. Okay. Oh, no, I'm an eagle. Oh, now we're gonna go. You swoop close to the spider web and find the huge spider guarding the entrance, taking her in your beak. You vow to get rid of her once and for all. Oh, snap, look at us. Oh, we're gonna drop her in the ocean. Snap. Oh. Oh, yeah. Right in the middle of the ocean. Poof. Good for you. Goodbye, spider. You are gonna be some hungry fish's food. That's awesome. We did a good job. And am I, are we gonna, your magic spell is wearing off. Your magic essence is all gone. Oh no, that's oh, okay. We did all we could do. And I'm gonna save. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The spider. Good job, everybody. Now we're gonna go into the cave, I believe. And, but uh, you have entered the cave of the Oracle. You are almost afraid to speak. Oh, hello. Uh, whoa, jeez. Creeper. The Oracle remains silent for a long time. Finally, you hear a hollow voice that seems to come from far away. I have been waiting for you all, all for... Blah. I have been waiting for you a long time, Gwydion. I have sorrowful news for you. Years ago, a terrible three-headed dragon invaded Daventry and keeps the people in a state of terror. This monster requires, once a year, the sacrifice of a young maiden. Holy. No way. Oh, hey. Hey now. Sadly, your own sister, Princess Rosella, is the chosen one this year. Time is running out of her, out for her, your parents, and Daventry. Oh no, Rosella. Poor Rosella. What do I do now? Tell me what I must do. You, Gwydion, the hollow voice continues. 
are the only one who can save them. But you must hurry. I have something to give you. A small stone of amber. Use it wisely, my friend. Ooh. The oracle grows silent again and seems to fall into a deep sleep. You attempt to thank the oracle, but the oracle does not respond. So I'm just going to go to bed. All right, so that was cool. And we're going to go up the mountain. I'm going to save really fast. Oops. And normal speed. I wish we could the. I wish we could just teleport all the way up there, all the way back up. That'd be really nice. So I don't have to do all this crap. But I mean, I guess they gotta make this game a little bit more interesting than it actually is. Uh, so I understand. I get it. But at the same time, I just don't want to do this <laughs> every time. Ugh, All right, so pretty much I dropped off the items and we're just gonna wait for Mananan to wake up But this is going to be the end of this episode and I hope you enjoyed it And please give it a like and subscribe if you haven't done so already and I will see you in the next episode Bye